important part is that China came, stood beside Pakistan, shoulder to shoulder, when no other country was willing to do so. This is important because, as we all know, it is the tough times that allow you to recognize your true friends. So 2013, while we celebrate 10 years of, uh, of CPEC, uh, was a very difficult year for us. I, I, I was also new in government then. Uh, to, and to have China step up uh, at, in 2013, none of this existed. This hall, this uh, converter station, I'm also fortunate because I visited some weeks ago uh, the Matiari end of the transmission line also, uh, is to have the sense uh, that uh, at that time, 10 years ago, when none of this was here, uh, that two of our leaders, Nawaz Sharif and Xi Jinping, had that vision that we have to take Pakistan forward. And uh, at that time, China stepped up, uh, and the leadership of His Excellency President Xi Jinping, uh, who committed China uh, to this, uh, if rather, at that time, the Belt and Road Initiative was just a Belt and Road Initiative. It didn't have any energy component. Uh, so it was Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif's advocacy uh, that Pakistan was short of energy, and uh, we needed not just generation, important part, but the transmission also of that energy. Uh, and uh, so thus CPEC took shape, uh, took uh, nearly two years for it to be signed, uh, but by grace of Allah Almighty and the leadership of our two leaders, uh, it finally began in 2015, uh, and we all stand here today uh, to celebrate the 1,000 days of successful operation of this 660 kV uh, high voltage direct current line. Uh, if people were wondering what HVDC means, uh, it's because uh, Essentially, the electricity that is generated is converted into direct current sent across the country, uh, and then it is converted at the other end again uh, to be used in our houses, in our factories, in our industries, uh, in our commercial areas. Uh, so it's, uh, uh, we are here uh, to acknowledge the iron brotherhood of our great friend China. Uh, which has made this uh, push forward uh, into Pakistan's uh, what we hope uh, will be uh, a better economic future uh, for the people of this country. Um, I'm also uh, delighted that uh, uh, in my current uh, responsibility uh, as Minister for Energy um, and in the leadership of Mohammad Shahbaz Sharif as Prime Minister, uh, we have completed uh, the unfinished agenda of CPEC over the last year. Um, we, Mr. Shahbaz Sharif as Prime Minister, inaugurated the Karot Electric Hydro uh, Project. He inaugurated both the Thal Nova and the Tel projects. Uh, and of course, uh, one of the key projects of Pakistan's future uh, the Shanghai Electric 1320 uh, megawatt Thar coal powered plant, uh, which is a, at the moment, the biggest demonstration that we have that Thar coal is feasible, Thar coal is usable, and Thar coal uh, will be a foundation of Pakistan's future energy generation. Uh, so, Shanghai Electric, uh, alhamdulillah, now is also in operation. I look at the numbers every day. Uh, it's, it's, it's working well. Uh, and also, uh, I've had this, uh, this final remark in English before I switch to Urdu. I've had this privilege of uh, watching this China-Pakistan economic partnership and Iron Brotherhood. As I said, I've seen it in the extreme south of the countries. 
uh, the southeast where Thar, the Shanghai Electric is located. And I've seen it in the mountains in Sukhi Kanari where I went to see uh, to uh, lay the uh, foundation stone uh, for the transmission line. So if uh, the, the question that is asked is, asked is uh, that, you know, uh, where is uh, China-Pakistan friendship? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are here to celebrate 886 kilometers of China-Pakistan friendship. This is what this project represents. <laughs> and um, the reason I say this is the, the, it is a commitment by China into the future of Pakistan is, is because over as CPEC was being developed, the south of the country, the areas near Karachi, in Thar, uh, in Port Qasim, uh, is becoming more and more important as an electricity generation area. One of the things that were also built, uh, which should not go unmentioned, are the K2 and K3 nuclear power plants, which have now become a foundation, again, a very important foundation uh, for Pakistan electricity generation. They, they are our, now our, one of the, our base loads uh, that we run all year, every day. Uh, and uh, if one of them goes offline, for repairs, uh, I get a fever because I, I want them to run every day, uh, every hour. So it's uh, so. The commitment to the future is that as the South becomes more. Head below, he may be faqir. Was it a tavanai? Khoram dastagir si pak takrib se khitab kare the.